Yo guys, it's your favourite frat boy Roscoe here and welcome back to another episode of the brilliant podcast that we all know and love as Discussing Nothing, uh, the show where we discuss so many things. But what does it all mean? Nothing. Nothing. Nothing, Nothing. indeed. Um, I'm joined by two brilliant co-workers of mine. I've got the nonchalant Tristan and the ostentatious Kelvin. Exactly. <laughs> Kelvin, your second podcast, how you feeling? How do you think the first one went? You were arguing. You were very pro cucumber. No, pro anti cucumber. Anti cucumber. Sorry. Yeah, you're very pro. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, jealousy of cucumber. Yeah. How you feeling? You ready to attack the day? Yeah, I'm not sure how this will go. Arguing with Tristan. Yes. Um, you've talked him up as yeah. a good arguer. So mm. I've got I'm skills. probably going to specialize in letting people down. So. <laughs> Well, you can use that against him. Um, Tristan, you ready for this? You ready for this? You're going to go to war. Are you ready to get personal? Yeah, got my coffee, you know. Yeah. Getting all hyped up on caffeine. Oh, quite right, quite right, quite right. Well, today, I have told the boys, we've come for another extremely original idea here, guys. I know, we're, we're going to discuss the best thing in the world, beginning with the D. Nothing profane now, boys, okay? Who would like to take the lead on this one? Such enthusiasm from the both of them. I'm going to go oh, for on. Kelvin. What's the best thing in the world beginning with D? Hit 2011 film, Drive. <laughs> Ooh, it's, a, it's a good one. Why? Um, primarily because it, for you know six months of the year, inspired males between the age of 12 and 57 <laughs> Into believing that they could pull off a velour scorpion jacket. I was one. Like Ryan Gosling. <laughs> to the. Bing, 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 you were one, bing, of, bing, you were one bing, of them. Bing, yeah. bing, 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 bing. I'm doing you want it for the, that song. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. Mm. Glad I left my one at home today. <laughs> Tristan. <laughs> best thing in the world beginning with D. Dolly the Sheep. The, the <laughs> Dolly the sheep. <laughs> I got it. I got it the first time. Uh, Calvin did. Can you explain <laughs> who Dolly the sheep is to those who wouldn't know who Dolly the sheep is? Dolly the sheep was like, the first like large mammal, I think, to be like cloned. <laughs> um, something like along those lines. Anyway, I don't know the exact exact scientific lingo. And <laughs> no, I think you got it. Dolly is now on display, dead, but on display. <laughs> Um, at, Stuffed uh, Edinburgh Like the <laughs> National Museum In Edinburgh So <laughs> Yeah any, any Care to elaborate anymore? What's No uh, on, on who Dolly Why is? is it the best thing? Because of Not only the doorways <laughs> The Dolly opened <laughs> But what uh, Dolly's creation Sort of represented For sort of Human advancement <laughs> And achievement It's quite Spectacular Really. Now, Kelvin, you didn't you didn't know beforehand what Ke uh, Tristan was going to bring to the table. No, nope. um, I didn't bring Dolly with me. You didn't bring Dolly. No, unfortunately, <laughs> in no. A, in a museum, <laughs> it would have been good to have Dolly here for scale and just to yeah. see our greatness. Well. Yeah, <laughs> about about <laughs> if you're if you're listening to this, it was about. <laughs> but uh, Kelvin, mm -hmm. you seem like a guy who's got strong opinions on Dolly the sheep, and I'm guessing bad ones. Uh, yeah, really bad. <laughs> For one, <laughs> I didn't know that that disgrace to nature was in our city here. <laughs> Not a big fan of sheep. Clone sheep. Oh, specifically clone sheep. Yeah, like sheep. that. That's an affront to, to God himself. <laughs> <laughs> Are you saying Dolly the sheep's unnatural? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that is what I'm saying. Do you think Dolly the sheep is a natural being? Yes. Oh, you, you believe in clone rights? Um, <laughs> I just believe that Dolly Dolly is a sheep, genetically identical to other sheep. Really? <laughs> now, I'm not a I'm a farm boy, as you well know. Mm. I hate sheep. So the fact that you would want to make more of them is baffling to me. Do you realise how stupid sheep are? Uh, they're pretty dumb. Yeah, you yeah, will be yeah. herding a flock of sheep. They will get to an open gate, and they'll all stand there at the open gate. And start discussing with one another and go, I'm not sure about this. And they'll choose to run into the fence instead of the actual, through the open gate. Do you think 
we need more sheep in this world? I think that Dolly, the appeal of Dolly isn't necessarily like <laughs> the ad- adding sheep, because <laughs> then any any lamb would be sort of like a good thing in my yeah. What was wrong life. with that? What was wrong with just just lamb? It's because of what it, 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 Dolly's creation allowed people to realize we like things can be cloned, and that opened like lots of like I think they discovered like a new cell. As a result, and stem cell research Ooh. took big steps forward. Mm. Um, and, you know, the, uh, just the idea of being able to clone things. <laughs> can, you, can you name anything else that's been cloned apart from Dolly? The Pyrenean Ibex. <laughs> <laughs> which? A type of mountain goat in ah, Spain, which yes. was going extinct. Sorry, sorry. And is now not extinct because they cloned it. Oh, really? Yeah. So can, uh, Dolly, Dolly is saving all because other of Dolly. species from extinction. Now, do you think that's down to Dolly or the scientists of Dolly? Well, you know, probably. Well, if Dolly never existed, yeah, no, Dolly. <laughs> it's down to Dolly. <laughs> now, drive. <laughs> oh, I forgot. Yeah, <laughs> we're, we've got a whole other point. Do you have any strong feelings about the movie Drive? bit slow isn't it yeah. <laughs> nothing really <laughs> happens uh yeah that's that's the point i think ryan gosling has a wonderful voice and you don't get to hear it enough oh yeah Do you, would you argue that he's not he's not doing enough of the old jibber jabber and drive and he's just doing a bit of too much no i mean the whole the aura that he exudes in that film is is the point of the character and the, the fact that he doesn't say much that you know that's that's what make audiences like him. It's all about the jacket, man. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever owned a scorpion jacket? <laughs> no. Is it a scorpion? It is a scorpion, yeah. isn't it? Mm. A big yellow scorpion on the back. <sighs> well, it's a good. It's a blooming good jacket, you know. Yeah, but yeah. I would argue, is Drive even the best movie beginning with D? Yes. Okay. Right. Fair enough. Good. Good argument. Uh, I've seen many mo- movies. I'm trying to think of a movie yeah, beginning with D. one more. Yeah. Uh, Dumbo. Dumbo. But yeah. <laughs> better than Dumbo. Okay. D- well, come on. We've uh, we've all seen Dumbo now. He's a flying elephant. Yeah, it's pretty good. Dumbo. Yeah, it's <laughs> pretty good. Um, Emma. <laughs> any strong opinions? Emma's here, by the way. Hello. She's the Emma of it all. No Ailen today, unfortunately. Um, you also seem. We all. I'm, Everyone has now. Everyone has strong opinions on Dolly the sheep. Okay, now we want to hear yours. Like, are you pro Dolly? Yes. Yes. I For think why? Tristan made several good points about the importance of her <laughs> having <laughs> <laughs> helped <laughs> the scientific community in their research mm-hmm. in regards to and we all life. Know it. We all know it. <laughs> <laughs> And any strong opinions on uh, Drive? I have not seen it. You've not seen it? <laughs> Alex, have you seen Drive? I've has seen anyone seen Drive scene. over there? No, Alex hasn't no. seen Drive. Alex, Alex hasn't Alex seen hasn't any seen films. Alex. Well, Alex, have you ever owned a velour jacket that has scorpions on the back? No. <laughs> That's <laughs> a shocker. Well, mm. Tristan, do you like the style of Drive? Do you think he's dressed well? Slag him off if you can. Tacky. Tacky, is, yeah. Is one word that I would use. Um... <laughs> <laughs> uh, just a bit of a <laughs> can't, can't. Got to watch my language here. He's a bit of a. Uh, he's pretty up himself, I would say. Yeah. The character. Yeah. Where, where's those stupid gloves as well? Don't need to drive. Yeah, because yeah, he's a driver. He drives. I, I have driven. <laughs> I have driven before. Yeah. I have never worn gloves. You don't pull on your white gloves to match your white jacket every time right. you step through in the also, car. Also, if he's if he's a getaway driver, drives yeah. an automatic. Yeah, yeah. And he <laughs> does he? He's barely even driving. That's a go kart. <laughs> he doesn't drive an automatic. I'm saying he does. <laughs> <laughs> you can't. You can't have an automatic if you don't have. You can't have like an automatic in movie if you don't have the the cuts to the the hand on the the gear. Yeah, because he goes between. It's when he's going between ch- reverse and drive, or well, <laughs> forward. I don't know. No, I think he's <laughs> driving like a classic, like like Mustang. So it wouldn't be an automatic. Yeah. And I mean, he's got you there. Disagree to disagree. Everyone knows a classic Mustang. It's not an automatic. So I, drive I, knew, different I, knew that. I know. I've known everything that we've talked about here today. Uh, but I will have to come to a decision. Um, now, Drive is a great movie. 
and I love the boom, 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 boom. But I tell you what, let you down today. You couldn't tell me why Drive was better than Dumbo, and that was a key falling part for you. And also, you didn't give me enough reasons as to why Dolly, great Dolly, which we all know and love. Rest in peace, Dolly. Um, I just don't think you gave me enough as to why Dolly wasn't as much of a pioneer in science as she was. Um, so I will have to give it to Dolly today. Um, no further questions. Um, the winner was Dolly the Sheep. Um, let's all bow our heads and remember Dolly. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> he was waiting for that one. <laughs>